Good morning everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are continuing with the theme of yesterday's video and we're going to explore some more hidden architectural features here at the convent. This morning the carpenter popped over and we've measured up loads of doors and internal doors so we're starting a little bit later today so let's crack on. We've got a slight issue everyone. There is a step into the chapel from this room and the lift won't go down that step because it will ruin the floor so we need to create a ramp because the thing we need to discover is above our heads. So let's make a ramp. Yes, this looks appropriate. And maybe these two pieces of timber. Yeah, that might do it. materials to make a ramp so let's try and make a ramp so I think that should go like that and if I put a few more bits of timber underneath this to support it that's okay that will probably snap in the middle hmm what have I got laying around That should go under here, like that. That bit goes under here, that bit goes under here. Let's try it. Oh no, it won't even fit. Gonna fit, is it? No. Let's try again. Okay. one. Alex is a little bit skeptical of my ramp and I am too so let's go for it. Oh, this is where it all goes wrong. Oops, I didn't think it would break. Oh, it moved. Let's try again. I forgot how much this thing weighs. It weighs 700 kilos. It doesn't look it, but it's heavy. All right, now we need to fix this mess. Ah, if I can get one of the wheels underneath, that would be perfect. <laughs> oh, almost. Ooh. Oh, good job I'm not stood on it. Okay, now we need to put a bit of wood here and a bit of wood here. There is method to the madness. Okay, that should do it. We need to get that bit of wood out. 
like this. There we go. I'll clean up my mess. So that was a little bit harder than expected, but we got through it. Um, so the thing I want to discover today is actually here. And it's an archway which has been covered over with MDF and ply. And I think behind it, there's a possibility of an original feature. So we need to get up there now and have a look. Here we are. Right, I need a tool. Okay, so we need to remove this ply cover. So let's just get the screwdriver in there. Try and pop it off. Okay, it's going well. Okay. And I thought it was going well. gloves really but yeah. okay not what I was expecting not what I was expecting at all best I remove the light bulb right Awesome. So we've discovered an arch, an archway which leads to that room. And they've lowered the ceiling so far that the original height is here, in that room. Look how low it is, it's just shocking. Obviously they did that because it probably retains heat better and there's more insulation. So it's more efficient to heat. But my plan is to remove this arch that they've put in, like these pieces, expose the original arch, take out that ceiling, and regain full height, which would make a huge archway. So I think what we should do now is remove this piece of plywood, remove some of the framework, and you'll see the full scale of it. So let's crack on.
didn't damage anything, did we? It's just a bar randomly sat there. We don't want to damage. Anyway, let's continue. Okay, mask on. Don't breathe in no fiberglass. Should be okay. Won't be too messy. Okay. Wow. And now we can see the original ceiling. We've got a bit of an issue. Can you see that huge steel RSJ? Well, that is currently supporting a sagging beam above it. And it appears there's only one, which is not ideal because I was hoping we'd end up with a higher ceiling. Um, hmm. Wow. Pretty amazing, the amount of work that they put into it. So a fantastic discovery, but the only issue is that huge steel beam, which is supporting the old original saggy beam above it. And if we do renovate this room, I don't want ceilings this low. I want them original height. So we will have to remove the RSJ, remove the original beam and replace it with a brand new wooden beam. And we'd have to acro both sides completely to support the floor above because above this is actually the office and um, replacing the rotten beam with a new one will probably be quite costly but it'd be worth doing because we'll gain the original height and it will look amazing once it's done so the only issue with this ceiling is it's going to be a messy job and yeah I don't want to start it right now because we need to finish the kitchen the hallway and the other room but it's always fun to discover things which are hidden above the ceilings so yeah fantastic i'm glad we looked and yeah a nice discovery ryan's planning on going to the deshettery today so i might as well join him and fill up the transit so yeah let's load up all this wood that we don't need and go down the deshettery We're off to the Deschettery. Yeah. And uh, we've mostly got Ryan's apartment in the back. Yeah, Billy to the rescue. Um, nice and slow. We don't want to run anyone over. No. Quite hectic today, isn't it? Is it? There's more than five cars on the road, which is not normal. Well, now there's none, now there's none. But before there was about five. Yeah. What's France coming to, eh? It's just not the same as the good old days when there were no cars on the road. I miss those days. Horse and cart, we should go back to horse and cart. Cobbled streets. Go and pick up your baguette in the morning. I'm letting Billy drive today because it is his car after all, or van I should say. Is a van a car? Not, Nothing's blown off, has no, it? No, I don't think anything's blown off. Did you move the, the, the bags, Bill? The no, black bag? no, I didn't move them. I did move them, yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh no, there's a car. There's a car. It's oh. got quite a big trailer as well, so it would probably take a while. Oh, don't say that. There we go. Bonjour. Ouais, 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 tout venant. Et puis un peu de bois et euh... et c'est tout. C'est voilà. tout. Ouais. Ouais, c'est voilà. Très bien. <laughs> Merci. He's a nice chap, isn't he? Oh, I love him. Oh, oh seriously, you do. I'm not even joking.
I'm so strong. Some of this isn't actually my rubbish that we're throwing away, which, um, you know, not being rude or anything, but I'm a busy man. I've got my own project. And I've got, yeah. This I'm is having, your rubbish, by the way. Well, it's from your convent. So technically it's your rubbish. You're so lucky to have me, you know that. Don't run anyone over, please. <gasps> We've got a nicer tipper than them, haven't we? Yeah. Try not to poke my eye out, Billy. I've only got two of them. You did a good job this time, separating everything. Yeah, I, I did. Um, two vinyl. Number eight. This is all two vinyl. Yeah. You gonna come? I'm coming. Oh, it's a bit tight. This is two vinyl as well. Can we put it in here? Should we ask him? He's just there, Ryan. Where is he? Over there. Excusez-moi, on, on peut utiliser la neuf pour tout venant ou pas Non, non, parce qu'il faut qu'on aille dans l'autre pour pouvoir aller faire vider. Ça marche, ouais, ouais, pas de soucis. La number eight. Eight. Well, we've got to wait told. for that van to go. It's all clear. Go on, you're good. Keep going, keep going, you're good, you're good. Keep going, keep going. Oh, you can come forward into it if you want, Bill. I'll come forward into it a Yeah, bit, come yeah. forward into it. There's no cars coming, you're good. So much talent behind the wheel. I'm impressed. Why is my hand really sticky? <laughs> <laughs> is it one of your bags? <laughs> oh, the bags, yeah, that's why. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? This was once a wall. Now look at it. I've got wood. It's a big one. Pinch my nipple again. Can't believe I've done that again. Second time. Oh, I'm gonna get I'm a shovel and a broom, mate. Yeah. I'm stuck. Any nails? Yeah. Oh, great. Got loads of them. Oh. A shovel and a broom. broom. Oh, good bit of exercise. What's up? You're looking good. Wow. Beautiful people. There you go. Thank you. There we go, Ryan. Their shovel, their shovel's seen better days. It has, hasn't it? I think that'll be okay, Ryan. Yeah. Done. Where'd yeah, you get see. it from? Just, put it just here. here, yeah. Yeah, anywhere there. Okay. <clears throat> put this here, yeah. Oh. We're cracking on. We've just emptied the van and now we're cracking on with life. That rubbish is never going to be seen again by us. It's left our life forever. Back to the convent where there's lots more rubbish. So a very productive day, everyone. We have discovered an original hidden feature in the chapel. We've also discovered an issue with the ceiling in the room next door to it. The carpenter's been today. I didn't want to film any of the carpenter because he was just getting on with it, measuring. 
Um, so yeah, we'll see what his prices are when he sends me the bill. And we've been down to the Shettery. Always a good laugh with Ryan. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all tomorrow.